we have the Minox Neo Z64. This is our first device using Intel Bay Trail. Okay, so first let's look at the housing. It's slightly larger than our minis and it also comes with a power button unlike our mini devices. So also we have the SD card which can handle up to 64 GB. We have two USB ports, one microphone port, HDMI port, Ethernet and uh, the DC power in. We also have the external antenna. This is our, our strongest single band antenna we've used. It reaches up to 150 MPBS. So in terms of streaming online, this device is very capable. Okay, the Neo Z64 comes with 2 GB RAM, 32 GB eMMC. The reason for the large amount of eMMC is because this device, as well as handling Android 4.4, you can also install Windows 8.1. Obviously, Windows 8.1 is a slightly larger OS, which is why we need the more eMMC. Okay, then uh, comes with the 10 to 100 MPBS Ethernet, Wi-Fi, as already mentioned, Bluetooth 4.0, HDMI 1.4, and the audio jack as mentioned. Okay, so here we've installed Windows 8.1 on our demo at the exhibition. This isn't an RT version, this is a full OS. So really you can use the Z64 as a full-fledged Windows PC. It has an exceptionally small form factor, but it's capable of handing handling most users demands. We've been testing XBMC on the Neo Z64. Obviously the Windows version has been developed much longer than the Android version. So it offers many, uh, many more features and settings and the XBMC is therefore very strong on the Neo Z64. In terms of web browsing, of course it can handle this. It can handle all operations that everyone's familiar with on Windows. And it's also extremely fast and snappy. On benchmarking tests, the Neo Z64 gets exceptionally high scores. This is a very powerful Android mini PC, Windows mini PC.